Welcome back to the channel J Car Mania aboard the most advanced aircraft carrier in the world, the 2025 model of the USS Gerald R. Ford, CVN-78. This nuclear-powered supercarrier represents the cutting edge of naval engineering and power projection. Designed to replace the aging Nimitz-class carriers, the Ford class brings revolutionary changes that enhance capability, reduce crew workload, and ensure dominance in modern naval warfare. Commissioned in 2017 and now in full operational swing by 2025, the Gerald R. Ford has undergone extensive upgrades that reflect lessons learned from years of testing, trials, and global operations. Let's take you on a journey through the systems and innovations that make this carrier a true game changer. The first thing that sets the Ford apart is its power source. Two A1D nuclear reactors generate triple the electrical output of the previous generation, enabling the use of high-demand systems without compromising ship performance. This includes future technologies like directed energy weapons and advanced radar systems, which are already being tested aboard. At over 1,100 feet in length and displacing around 100,000 tons, the Ford is a floating city built for efficiency and power. Its island superstructure has been repositioned further aft compared to the Nimitz class, allowing for improved flight deck flow and more efficient aircraft operations. The result is a 25% increase in sortie generation rate, meaning more aircraft in the air faster and more often. Speaking of aircraft, the Ford class is designed to support both current and future air wings. It accommodates the FA-18E F Super Hornets, EA-18G Growlers, E-2D Advanced Hawkeyes, MH-60RS Seahawks, and the fifth-generation F-35C Lightning II Stealth Fighters. The deck also supports unmanned systems like the MQ-25 Stingray, which provides carrier-based aerial refueling, significantly extending the range of manned aircraft. Launch and recovery of aircraft have seen a major leap forward with the Electromagnetic Aircraft Launch System, or EMALS, replacing the steam catapults used on older carriers. EMALS allows for more precise launches with less wear on aircraft, quicker cycle times, and the ability to launch lighter or more varied types of aircraft, including drones. On the recovery side, the advanced arresting gear system increases reliability and reduces stress on airframes, making carrier landings safer and more efficient. The Ford class was designed with automation in mind. A smaller crew, approximately 600 fewer sailors than on a Nimitz class carrier, is required to run the ship, thanks to automated systems and improved workflow designs. This not only reduces operating costs but also frees up space for more mission-critical components and improves quality of life on board. Below decks, the Ford's enhanced weapons handling systems allow for faster and safer movement of munitions from magazines to aircraft. These improvements reduce the time between sorties and significantly enhance the ship's ability to sustain high-intensity operations over time. Radar and communications are also state-of-the-art. The, the dual-band radar system, combining X-band and S-band capabilities, allows the Ford to simultaneously conduct air traffic control, missile defense, and air search functions. This integrated system improves reaction times, situational awareness, and target tracking in complex environments. Defense is always a top priority. The ship comes equipped with the latest in close-in weapons systems, including the Phalanx CIWS, RIM-116 rolling airframe missiles, and ESSM launchers. Coupled with electronic warfare capabilities and advanced decoys, the Ford is prepared to defend itself against a full spectrum of threats, from missiles to small boats. Looking forward, the Gerald R. Ford is built with adaptability in mind. Its modular systems and increased electrical capacity mean it can integrate future weapons like lasers or railguns without requiring major redesigns. In essence, it's a ship built for the future, a platform that will evolve alongside the threats and missions of the 21st century. As of 2025, the USS Gerald R. Ford has already participated in multiple global deployments, leading carrier strike groups across the Atlantic, Mediterranean, and beyond. It has set new benchmarks in operational tempo, joint force integration, and multi-domain warfare. The USS Gerald R. Ford is more than a warship. It's a symbol of American naval strength, deterrence, and technological excellence. It redefines what it means to be the flagship of freedom on the seas. Whether it's providing air support, humanitarian relief, 
or standing watch in contested waters, CVN 78 is ready for whatever the future demands. Thanks for watching.